It is Monday, October the 18th. I'm Juliana Pinzone, and this is the Mariner Report. Good morning, Mariners. Welcome to week eight of our learning adventure. As we threatened in an earlier broadcast, TMR will be offering you a look inside some of the advisories that are happening on campus. Our first advisory spotlight is no yolk. I'm Missy Zell and I teach the egg drop advisory and I've been teaching it now for about 15 years I'd say. Uh, what is egg drop? Egg drop is an opportunity for kids to work together like engineers. They work through four different um, egg drops. Each one is different. Each one has different constraints. Kids get to work together, revise their designs. It's a lot of fun. Process of how you drop the eggs. Well, the process is kind of like I stated. The kids are put through four different challenges. Um, each challenge has different rules, different materials, um, and the eggs are dropped from the roof out where the PE kids meet for roll. It's about 25 feet for each drop, so um, it's pretty exciting watching their eggs fall out of the roof to see if they were able to meet the challenge and did their eggs survive or did it fail. Uh, what did you take away from this advisory? I think kids take away, um, you know, school can be a lot of fun. Kids get to work with their friends. They also get to meet new friends. So many kids come in, they don't really know anybody in the class, but, you know, I'll pair them with somebody else that might not know somebody and, and then they can be friends. I think that happened when you were yeah. in this class. So it's a lot of fun. Hopefully you check that box when you fill in your advisory exploration choices. Thank you. Welcome. Next weekend is Halloween, Mariners, and Mr. Melville's awesome ASB has a week's worth of spirit and a party planned. What's up, ASB? Hello, Mariners! We're part of ASB, and as some of you may know, there is going to be a Halloween-themed party. November 29th, from our calendar. There'll be games, food, and be sure to wear your Halloween costumes because there'll be a contest. Swing by the ASB room to buy your tickets that are only $5. This week we are selling Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Spirit Week will also be the week of the dance. Monday, professional versus lazy day. Tuesday is tourist day. Wednesday, we wear pink. Thursday is pajama day. And Friday is when we wear our Halloween costumes. This 
Friday is a very special day. It's a birthday of someone very close to the Marston community. Any guesses? It's the man who the Marston community was named after. October 22nd is George Marston's birthday. So who was this man so important to have a school named after him? George Marston was a politician, the owner of a popular department store, who gave our city major parks and other great institutions. His dream was to make San Diego one of America's greatest cities. Marston was born in 1850 in Wisconsin. His family moved west because of his father's poor health, and George, the future millionaire, started in business here as a low-lie hotel clerk. In time, he created the Marston Company, which became the only major department store in San Diego. It sat at the corner of 5th Avenue and C Street downtown. He was known as a good boss and businessman who invested in keeping his store nice and treating customers right. He married a teacher named Anna Lee Gunn and together the couple had five children. Their beautiful home, the Marston House, lies at the western edge of Balboa Park and it is open to the public as a museum. Our school was named after George Marston for being a great man and shaping San Diego into what it is today. A very happy birthday to you, Mr. Marston. Thank you for all you did for our city. And that's it for this week, Mariners. Hey, a couple things about the dance on the 29th. The dance is for one hour, 2.40 to 3.45. And if you're attending, plan on staying for the whole time because you won't be allowed to leave early. Today is Monday, October the 18th, 2021. I'm Juliana Pinzone, signing off for the Mariner Report. Have a great rest of your week.